Hello my lovelies. Taurus, this is going to be your week ahead. We're going to use the Celtic cross spread today. We're going to see what is your current situation. What does my Taurus sun, moon, rising, and Venus need to see for the week? Ooh, I like that. The spark of creativity. So your current situation is challenging you to really um, expand on things. Where, where and what are your passions? What is the driving force? Is it, um, you know, sexual passion and chemistry? Is it creativity? But these are new possibilities that are coming in. So following through with a creative venture, a passion project, or even a passionate new encounter. Your challenge this week. Could be that you need to see that things are changing for the better financially. So a period of recovery coming in. Why is that a challenge, Spirit? I feel like... Um, I feel like you're doubting that things can get better. And so the creativity is what's going to help usher in these changes for the better. So let go of the fear, let go of the worry. Now that that's a blockage to your finances improving, believe that they can change for the better and watch things usher into change. Your focus this week, ooh, could be on love. So yeah, you might have some passion towards somebody. You might be wanting to make a commitment, maybe marriage, solidify some things. I feel like this is an opportunity for you to also grow in this connection. And I feel like this is somebody that you will grow with. Um, I feel like they've also had some growth on their part of things. And so it's like things are coming into alignment for you two to magnetically kind of attract one another. Love that. All right. In your recent past, we're letting go of some burdens. We're letting go of these heavy things that have weighed us down, maybe responsibility, duties, and we're releasing those things. So that's a welcome to change some possibilities in the near future. You could have somebody coming in that brings that excitement, that um, is a bit of a rebel, somebody that kind of excites you because they're a bit dark or dangerous. But I feel like this person is not really the committal type. So that might be something that is a bit of a challenge for you as well. But there is some sort of news coming in. So whether it's a new possibility of somebody new coming in or um, I just feel like there's this new energy that's shifting for you this week, especially where love is concerned. All right, let's see. In your near future, what do we need to see? There will be some sort of decision. So I feel like you're going to be faced with the possibility of two people that you have to decide which one is right for you. You have one that's very fun and outgoing, somebody who's really passionate and exciting. You also have somebody who's very emotional, somebody who um, wants a commitment. And so you may be kind of struggling on which is a better fit for you. Trust your intuition, trust your heart. What does it tell you? What does it want? What are the pros and cons of each of these? Because I feel like there will be a decision that needs to be reached. Um, I also feel like you could potentially be choosing yourself over either of these. And so I think that you need to be cautious of your choices this week. So really choose what's going to work best for you. All right. The power that you hold this week. You have the power to transform something where you have been living in survival mode, where things have been really toxic, um, like self-destruct is what they're telling me. It's time to pull yourself out of the pits of hell and go forward in a better position, a better solution. Uh, they're saying that you will no longer be living in survival mode, that you're finally going to be able to come out on top. Okay, so your environmental factors. There could be some sort of legal issue that's settled in your favor. Uh, courts, contracts, legalities, marriage is a contract. We have the two of cups out here. You might be wanting to just run off and get married to this person. Um, make sure you know who you're getting involved with. Don't make any crazy decisions that are going to hurt you later. But I feel like this could be a positive change. Maybe somebody works in the Justice Department in some capacity, law enforcement, uh, courts, lawyers, things like that. But there's some sort of balance that's trying to be restored. All right, your hopes and action needed. You're hoping that things can change mentally. And I feel like mentally you're really struggling. And I feel like that's something that needs to be addressed. So get out of the negative mindset. And if you can't, seek some sort of expert advice to help. I feel like this is more of a mindset that needs to change than anything else. 
And if you're constantly thinking negative, well, then that's what your vibration is, is it's negative. We want to shift that. We want it to be more positive. Why can't everything work out for you in the best possible way? Why does it always have to be negative? It doesn't, right? It doesn't have to be. So if you start saying to yourself, the best person is going to come into my life because they're meant for me. I'm going to be wealthy because it's something that I deserve. Um, like all the best possible things happen to me at just the right time because I am exactly where I need to be. Watch your world shift for the better instead of everything's negative, nothing ever works out for me, I'll never find this, I'll never do that. Don't tell yourself those things. Flip the script, change it for the better. Start speaking positive words over your life and watch it change for the better. Your outcome this week is a fucking victory. So change it for the better. Why? Because you deserve this. You've worked very hard. The Six of Wands is telling you that you're going to have some sort of recognition. Potentially the spotlight's going to be on you, that there's some sort of reward, fame, fortune, whatever. But people are starting to notice you and they're starting to actually um, give you like the respect and encouragement that you deserve, the attention that you have earned. So things can really change for the better. Shift your perspective and see that things can be positive instead of negative. Have a great week.